we're going to pick up my husband's prescription. My husband has had an ear infection for I think a month. <laughs> we couldn't get to the doctor. We kept calling the doctor and the doctor would say, we're gonna call you back and they never called back. And he kept calling and calling and they'd be like, we're gonna get back to you. And they never got back to us. They never got back to him. So finally, I was Googling, you know, ear infections and why, you know, what happens when they won't go away. Cause he did take, you know, an antibiotic. He actually did go to the doctor one time a month ago and they wound up giving him an antibiotic, but then he went back, but then it didn't go away. So we were trying to go back and find out what should we do now because it wasn't going away. And they were not calling us back. So finally, you know, it's been going on a month. And so finally I was Googling it and they said, if you don't, you know, take care of an ear infection, it could, you could wind up needing surgery. It could turn into all kinds of horrible things. So I was like, I, I told my husband, I was like, you gotta, we gotta get them on the phone. We're gonna go there. We're gonna go in the door. We're gonna do something. So finally, I don't know what happened, but finally he was able to get them on the phone and we got, could you have to get a referral to go to a, a ear, a spe an ear specialist? So he finally got the ear specialist. He finally went today. The ear specialist was like, oh my goodness. He had uh, so many things going on. <laughs> they said, we can't believe you're not deaf which actually will happen if it, if you leave the ear infection and you don't get to the doctor and you leave it like that, you can wind up losing your hearing. So it's really serious. And um, so now, thank goodness, he got the prescription and the doctor is able, you know, it actually wasn't an ear infection, it was something else. So he gave him a different medicine for what he needed. So we're gonna go now and pick up the medicine, thank goodness. And I'm so happy to be leaving the house. Oh, here's my husband. They've been working on my house all day and then apparently they're gonna be working on it for like a month. So um, it's gonna, it's, it's crazy because the dogs go bark, especially of course, Roxy, she barks so loud. And when, you know, when she's barking so loud, it's, she doesn't stop. So, <laughs> so I don't mind though, because I, I love her so much, but. Uh, it is a lot, she's loud. And so she doesn't like when the, um, you know, when the people are here, the sun is moving, it was moving in and out the clouds, but now it's come out of the clouds, so it's way better. Okay, so uh, yeah, so they're gonna be, we're, what we're doing is we're getting a new lawn put in because our lawn got all torn up. So they're gonna tear up what we do have, which is kind of like, <laughs> I'll show you, it's a, it's a mess, it's a mess. But um, yeah, so when the people come to work on the house, Roxy goes crazy and she barks nonstop. So she's been barking all day because today the electrician came and he put, we got new lighting, new floodlights in the yard. So he um, has been working on that. And so I'll show you guys, but what ha why we have to get this though is because the dogs, if the, the lawn, we're actually getting that faux turf, it's, you know, fake grass. <laughs> Faux. I have to say faux dirt. It's fake grass. But no, it's beautiful. So it looked beautiful. They gave us a sample. It looks beautiful. But what's happening is the dogs are tearing up the dirt and they're going in the house and they're getting dirt all over the house. Essentially it's Roxy because Louie and Lola don't really do that much. <laughs> they don't do all that. But anyway, guys, my husband is here now. So they're going to be here for like two weeks. Also, they're fixing our roof. So we have a lot going on. So it's going to be kind of, you know, madness. But um, and now we're gonna go get the prescription for my husband. And then we're gonna, you know, I just wanted to show you guys. I found these leggings on Amazon. They're an exact Lululemon, they're exact Lululemon dope, dupe, dope, I said dope, dupe. They are an exact, let's say that again. They're an exact dupe for Lululemon. I can't believe it. They're the exact, I'm wearing them now. They're the exact same material. They're so silky. They were like 20 some odd dollars on Amazon. This now is an exact Skims dupe. If I got the t-shirt. If you like the t-shirt, those Skims t-shirts. Now this one that I have on is a little cropped, but they do have longer ones. So this t-shirt here is an exact dupe for the, for the Skims. Same exact material. Now the, the Pumi actually is feels the same, but it's a little thicker. This material from this brand, I believe it's called Pavoy is thinner like the skims so you know i kind of like that 
it's more it's gonna I hope you can hear that but um amazing i got a bunch of leggings from them so i was gonna show you guys and um i was really excited guys i just got an email from charlotte tilbury well I, you know i'm on the email alerts and she's coming out with a new perfume four new perfumes they sound amazing so she's gonna email if you get signed up for the email alerts she's gonna email everybody when they're you know when they're released so hopefully it'll be soon because they again they sound amazing so i'm very excited to get my hands on one at least they're, they're supposed to evoke emotions in you like one is called morris my husband so i do you know anyway <laughs> i love a sexy perfume so i can't wait till she comes out with those hopefully maybe it'll be very soon and anyway now we're gonna head out to we gotta get food too so we're gonna and tomorrow i gotta go to my doctor's appointments so i guess we got a lot going on I'm gonna try to go do some shopping tomorrow because my doctor is right by the, the Chanel boutique in New York City So or Bergdorf's or something. I'm gonna go somewhere. I haven't left the house in so long So anyway guys, um, yeah, we're just gonna head out now. My husband's waiting for me So I'll be back and guys these are actually the leggings So I just wanted to show you this is the top And I hope you can even maybe see it's the same exact material as the skims but again, they do have longer ones. I didn't realize this one was so crap. I don't mind it, it's cute. But here's the outfit, here's the leggings. Here they are, very stretchy, very comfortable, seamless in the front, love that. And a great fit, and they're just the exact material. They're so soft, they're so comfy. Just like the Lululemon, just like the Skims material. So, wow, I was so shocked when I saw that. But anyway, this is just what I'm wearing today. This is my H&M jacket. I actually got this in Pasadena. Cute bag here. So let me show you this. This is a full ensemble. <laughs> Sneakers. So, oh guys, there's butterflies. The butterflies are coming out. The cocoons. There's, we've seen like them, we've seen one basically with the cocoon still like hanging off them. And let me show you, maybe I can show, oh, he flew away. There was another one right there. Guys, here's some cushions too that I got at Home Goods. These are Brooks Brothers. They were two for $24.99. So I wound up getting two, of course, because they came as a set. And these are my Thomasville chair set. I love it. Uh, I got this at Home Goods too for about $200. It also came with the table. So love that. And here's where they were putting in the new lights today. My husband's getting a putting green. So he's going to put it, I think, over here or over here. I'm not sure. And then see how our, our grass never, our grass was growing, but it got torn up. So as you can see, it's a huge mess. So what happens is they bring all the dirt in the house. So we have to get the fake grass. Which is nice. It's gonna. It's it's really beautiful. I was so surprised. It's really nice, and it's very soft too. So hopefully that will work out good for us. But you see how it's all just dirty looking, and it's there's no rehabbing it. There's we've tried for like a few years now, and it just just something always happens. So anyway, we're gonna head out now. So I'll to chat with you guys later. So we just got home. I just went to the supermarket. We picked up my husband's prescriptions. So we've been all over the place. But you guys, I also just got a package from Amazon. So I'm really excited to see what it is. I did order some Patrice makeup. So I'm really excited because I think this is what I ordered. You guys, it is. It's the Catrice Melted Sun Cream Bronzer. Now, I don't know if this is new. I just see things on, you know, on Amazon pops up. And I just probably like Amazon bestsellers. And I can't resist. So can I try this on right now? I just want to, I really want to try that. Because I just love cream bronzers. And it'd be so great to find a good one and save. And then what is this here? Oh, this I believe is a color changing lip oil that I got on Amazon. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what this is. Liquid, oh, lip oil. 
it's kind of burlesque lip oil so that'll be fun to test out maybe i do have on my tilbury charlotte tilbury collagen lip bath i've been loving that i ordered a new one in the sale but i got the i think i got the new fairest color collection colors i know i got the lipstick this is coming in the mail i just ordered it the other day from the sale the sephora sale but i just really want to test this out really quick this is again the catrice melted sun in beach babe oh let's see here oh that that is so dark Oh, I hope you guys can see, but I got the wrong shade, apparently. Or it's the brush. But, you know, when I blend it out. Let's see when we blend it out. But that first... <laughs> the first application wasn't too much. Let's try the beauty sponge with this. Oh, that's much better. Okay, thank goodness. <laughs> you know, it's not the end of the world, but it did look like a hot mess for there, right there for a minute. So, actually, this is gorgeous. I just, you know, did I use too much product? Probably. But once you blend it out, wow. Okay, this definitely is drugstore better than high end. As long as it doesn't break up on me and things like that. But I like this better than the Chanel bronzer. That's what I was actually looking for a dupe for. Because I've been using that Chanel Le Beige, I believe. What is it? The Healthy Glow. Um, yeah, Le Beige Cream Healthy Glow Bronzing Cream. But this is really... You know, it's nothing that you must, it's not a must have, especially if you can find a product like this. Now, this is a dupe. This is gorgeous. This is better. I like this better. Look how creamy it is. I hope you can see. So beautiful. It really has a radiance to it as well. Maybe the creaminess, but it just, it, it looks beautiful on the skin. So. This is a win. This is a good one, you guys. I'll be back. When that runs out, I will definitely want more. Have you really tried this before? I'm sure it's like, it has to be, you know, no more than $8. So I actually got the shade 020 Beach Bee. Maybe there's a lighter shade, but actually you don't, if you're a pale, I'm a pretty pale person, but if you blend it out, it looks beautiful. Maybe, you know, the sponge is the way to go. <laughs> Probably. These beauty blender, I got these, a bunch of these at Marshalls and look it came in this beautiful little kit container with the top that opens isn't that so cute I couldn't believe it I didn't realize I thought it was just sponges and then when I got it and I opened it it actually comes with this really nice container too and this was $12 so amazing Marshalls or <laughs> DJ Maxx buying guys I just wanted to update you on this shampoo that I purchased the other day at Ulta I don't know if you saw my little makeup and beauty haul but I pictured, I, I purchased this Andrew Fitzsimmons Prism Shine Shampoo and Conditioner. And can I tell you, I use it. It's amazing. It's amazing. I feel like my hair just looks so incredible. It looks, I just, I'm so happy with this, how my hair came out after I used this. I also did use the Color Wild Money Mist, though, for the first time. But um, this one, you can feel. It, you know, it feels different when you shampoo your hair. You, you feel that it um, leads, leaves this kind of silkiness to it that, and this feeling to it that I've never felt before. So, um, And then when I washed it out in the blow dryer, it was very sleek, smooth. Definitely, I felt like it does give shine to your hair. So um, I could not be more happy. I love it. I even like the scent. The scent is kind of multidimensional. It starts off one way, and then it turns into another. It's kind of like a strawberry scent. It's I, I don't know about the scent. Okay, the scent is, you know, it's fun. But <laughs> the hair, the what it did for my hair, amazing. I could not recommend this more. And again, I don't know if you saw my other video, but this is about $9.00 at Ulta so it's pretty affordable because the other shampoo I was using the IGK is like almost $30 the way these shampoos are the, the Orbe they're so expensive this is definitely an amazing alternative if you like those Orbe shampoos and things like that because I like those too but this and I love this so it's right up there in quality and what but I actually like it better what it will do for your hair so amazing i'm so glad i found this and because i even if you just mix it in with maybe your more expensive shampoo you know trade it up i think you will love this because you know either way if you're a luxury shampoo lover you will love this <laughs> you know it will help your other ones to last longer because you can again mix this in between shampoos but if you're you know just a shampoo lover this i just love this this is i think you would love this it's amazing and i think they have more shampoos there's more to the one but this is only the one that I've tried, Prism Shine. 
amazing. So I can't recommend that more, guys. Definitely, if you're into hair like me, I love, you know, I love to have shiny hair. I think that, that that's amazing. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for spending time with me today. I will be back soon. Tomorrow I'm going into the city, so I was hoping I'll take you guys along with me. We'll see if I can do that. I would love to. You know, maybe we could do some shopping. And, you know, that's pretty much it. So I hope your beauties are all doing good, and I'll see you very soon.